The Titicaca Lake is the highest navigable lake in the world. It's not only an unbelievable source of fresh with water, it's also the hydroclimatic factor that makes life possible throughout the highlands, and it's two hours from La Paz City. Unfortunately, in recent years on these shores, an increasingly extensive visual serve a green layer that gives off a full smell when drying. That green layer is due to a plant called duckweed. Hello, my name is Jair, and this is my family. My mom, Sandra, My dad Francisco and my little brother Jaciel. We live in La Paz in Bolivia. This is our city. Here's Yellow Cable Way. I have my project called Lemna Backbox. Cleaner of the grid. I have decided to do this project because of the pollution problems that the landfill is causing in the Titicaca Lake and also other rivers and lakes in the world. The duckweed is an aquatic plant with flat and oval leaves joined together by a small bunch of roots. Its color is green. The tiny plant reproduces an interval of 18 hours. The lentils can deteriorate the quality of the waters and make disappear species of flora and fauna that require cold, clean and well oxygenated water. The presence of duckweed is an indicator of contamination. In the bottom of the lake was found rotten moods where absolutely nothing can grow because it doesn't receive enough light or oxygen. The fish have fled from that environment and those who remain are sick or dying. My project is the solution to end the problem caused by duckweed. Once the problem has been eradicated, the landfill can be reused as animal feed, also to make gasoline and to purify the water by controlling its reproduction. I thought about this solution because these plants are easy to aspirate because they do not weigh too much, they are small, they are joined, and they can be vacuumed several at the same time. The dark with cleaner rubber consists of an engine that activates a propeller and allows the prototype to be propelled forward a camera that observes and takes pictures of the plants found in the water, a Raspberry Pi that directs the movement of a fin to direct the prototype. It will also receive photos taken by the camera, and it will control the activation of the vacuum cleaner. It uses artificial intelligence with machine learning too. The prototype observes through the camera the plant, identifies them, and makes the recognition with artificial intelligence if it finds the dark wheat, it sends a signal to the vacuum to activate it. We create a model with machine learning that has photos of the lentil from all the angles to make it more accurate. Every time he picks up new images, it will feed back the information. Without artificial intelligence, it could not be done. It will be take a lot of time in another way. When the container is full, it sends a signal with its location through the Raspberry Pi to an application to say that this has already been filled and needs to be downloaded. of using this project using artificial intelligence are framed within a social economic and environmental plan allowing sustainability to benefit the population around the Titicaca Lake and its ecosystem. Let's take care of our lakes and add our land. I, I love my planet.